Good day, Nighthawks. Broadcasting from my home to yours, I am Matthew Nolan with your daily dose of HHS News. Today is Friday, the 29th of May, 2020. We will be bringing you the HHS News every weekday, along with a segment on good citizenship and filled with American patriotism once a week. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. An update for locker cleanout, yearbooks, and Chromebooks. Underclassmen, locker cleanout is optional for underclassmen only. You do not have to come to clean out your locker. Your things can remain in your locker through the summer until we return to school. However, if you choose to come to retrieve your belongings, you must follow this schedule. Today, Friday the 29th of May, 2020, last name is beginning with R through Z, may enter the building from 9 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. Underclassmen should bring a bag in which to carry your, their belongings. Please remember all textbooks, library books, as well as school issued uniforms and equipment should be returned at this time. You do not have to return your Chromebooks. This year, you will be keeping them for the summer. Please let Mrs. Halk or Mr. Abels know if your Chromebook is broken or in need of repair. Seniors, your schedule will be as follows. On Monday, the 1st of June, 2020, last names beginning with A through E may enter the building from 8.30 to 9.30 a.m. Last name is beginning with F through K may enter the building from 9.45 to 10.45 a.m. Last name is beginning with L through M may enter the building from 11 to 12 noon. Last name is beginning with N through P may enter the building from 12.15 to 1.15 p.m. And last name is beginning with R through Z may enter the building from 1.30 to 2.30 p.m. Seniors should also bring a bag in which to carry their belongings. Please return all textbooks, library books, as well as school-issued uniforms and equipment. Seniors that have paid all obligations will also be receiving their cap and gowns during their assigned time. Also, seniors, please bring your Chromebooks, chargers, and carrying bag with you at your assigned time. Please remember that all students must wear a mask when entering the building. All students should enter through the main entrance of the high school. Entry will not be permitted in any other entrance. Students will exit using the gymnasium doors. As students arrive, they should stand at the assigned marker to allow for appropriate social distancing. It is important that students follow the schedule above to ensure that social distancing measures can be followed. Your books have arrived and will be distributed at your assigned locker cleanout time. Well, my weekly citizenship and patriotism segment. Summer vacation is an excellent time to increase citizenship. With the time you have this summer, I encourage you to become involved in your country, to take a stand with our flag, and to do your duty to this great nation. An investment in patriotism is one that will never produce faulty returns. An investment in patriotism is one that will forever preserve liberty and freedom in our nation. On this day in history, at 12.30 a.m. on the 29th of May, 1953, Edmund Hillary of New Zealand and Tenzing Norgay, a Sherpa from Nepal, reached 29,035 foot peak of Mount Everest. Both were immediately hailed as heroes for being the first to successfully summit the highest peak on Earth. Hillary was knighted by Queen Elizabeth II, and Norgay was given the Empire Medal because he was not a citizen of a British Commonwealth. In global affairs, the U.S. coronavirus death toll has surpassed 100,000. Despite this grim mark, all 50 states have begun partial or total reopening. And then SpaceX NASA launched the Falcon 9 rocket with the Dragon Crew capsule and two American astronauts to the International Space Station has been postponed to Saturday the 30th of May 2020 at 322 Eastern Daylight Time due to weather issues in Cape Canaveral, Florida, on Thursday. The launch will be the first launch to carry U.S. astronauts from U.S. soil in nine years, and the first time a private corporation is sponsoring the flight. It will also be the first time in 40 years that a new rocket would be used by Americans to carry American astronauts to space. And now for the last part of our senior segment portion of the show. Congratulations again to the class of 2020. A special thanks goes to Ben Newman, who will be headed to Liberty University next year. Many thanks for being our producer and anchor on the show. We will miss all of you and wish you the best of luck here from all of us here at HHS News. Check out this final segment.
Thank you all for watching and tune in every day at 8.30 for more HHS news. Many thanks for your continued support during these unprecedented times. I hope you all have a great day, as well as a great summer. Stay safe. I am Matthew Enon, checking out for one last time of the 2019-2020 school year.